At Minecraft Live 2023, back on October the 15th, Maljang Studios did give us our first ever look at Minecraft 1.21, the future of the game. And recently, there has been a lot of information uncovered, suggesting we could be getting a whole new dimension as a part of this update. In this video, we're going to be going over all of the latest information from the Minecraft developers, along with some theories and suggestions from the community to better understand, is this true? Are are we getting a whole new dimension as a part of Minecraft 1.21? With that being said, be sure to let me know what team you are on down below in the comments and subscribe for more Minecraft news. So this all actually begins with the Breeze mob which was of course announced at Minecraft Live 2023 back on October the 15th. This was posted to the official Minecraft Twitter account saying the new mob from Minecraft Live, the Breeze. The Breeze is a playful but dangerous hostile mob you can find during your journey through the trial chamber. It uses attacks like wind charge and wind burst that'll transform the room you're fighting in. Obviously a very awesome mob. Since then there have been a number of articles and videos made suggesting that this mob could be the key to Minecraft 1.21's secrets. In case you're not aware though, the breeze is most likely heavily inspired by this mob from Minecraft Dungeons, which is awesome. The key though is that it actually uses wind to attack the player. King B Dogs, a Minecraft gameplay developer at Mojang, did also tweet this on October the 15th, saying how do you feel about what we've shown of 1.21 so far? Again, this is just the beginning. We will reveal other things for the update leading up to its reveal. Obviously though, this does just state the obvious. What Mojang did show us at Minecraft Live 2023 is only the beginning, that is the content they have complete already. And this is where many of the theories and rumours do start to come into things. Let's now talk about the new dimension, which people seem to be talking about quite a bit, the possibility of a whole new dimension being added to Minecraft. Obviously, many people are let down by Minecraft 1.21 right now, and that is because many people were hyped up about an end update. Or maybe a deep dark dimension, as was hinted by that mysterious portal at the centre of the ancient cities. But at least as of right now, none of that seems to be happening. What is much more likely is the ether dimension or sky dimension. That seems a bit insane to suggest, but trust me, it does make sense. The most similar mob we have to the breeze right now is the blaze. And it makes sense, Minecraft is a very consistent game. The blaze shoots fire, so naturally it spawns in the nether. Enderman and the ender dragon use the power of the void, they spawn in the end. But right now it just doesn't make sense how the breeze, which uses the power of the wind, can only spawn underground. Many people out there do believe that the breeze is going to be given a home, it is going to be given its own dimension, but it just has not been revealed yet. So let's say these theories are all true. Then what kind of a dimension could we be seeing in Minecraft 1.21? And I kind of answered this earlier on in the video, but I think the ether is by far the most likely candidate. As we saw last year, Maljang made some very interesting references to the ether dimension, which as you may know is the most popular Minecraft mod basically of all times, allowing you to go to the opposite of the nether, the ether dimension which is high up in the sky and is very peaceful. Just in case you do not know, King B Dogs is actually a developer on the ether mod. Correct me if I'm wrong but I believe the creator of the mod itself. So there's definitely a possibility that we could finally be getting some kind of a sky dimension in Minecraft 1.21. Some of you may be thinking though, what is the likelihood of that? Maljank have already revealed quite a bit of content, so why wouldn't they have revealed the new dimension if we are actually getting one? And the answer to that is very simple, most likely it is not complete yet. The new Maljang does like to reveal content when it is ready. So the crafter, the breeze, the trial chambers are all basically complete. That is why they were revealed, and if we go back to that King B Dogs tweet, there is much more Mojang is working on, which they have yet to reveal. So as I said, there's definitely a huge possibility that we could be seeing a new dimension added to Minecraft as a part of the 1.21 update. It is hard to deny how out of place the breeze does look, especially in the trial chambers. It does just seem like this mob needs a natural 
travel home, and I think the ether dimension high up in the clouds in the sky would make perfect sense for this mob. Especially when you consider that King B Dogs, the legendary mod developer of the Ether Dimension, is now actually working on Minecraft itself. I'm not saying that the exact Ether Dimension with the same glowstone portal and everything will be added to Minecraft, but maybe we could see something similar. I'm sure a lot of you watching this video might not be aware of this, but about 10 years ago when Minecraft was in the very early days, Notch, the game's original creator, did confirm that there was actually a Sky Dimension in development for a number of years, and at one point did even say consider it confirmed. So this is not like a new idea, it is not something that Mojang has never really thought about, this has been a concept for many developers working on Minecraft for a number of years, and as we have saw, when Mojang returns to its roots to do a classic Minecraft update as they did with the Nether update and the updated World Terrain Generation in the Caves and Clips update, it really works, and it is a great way of bringing back new and old players to the game. So I definitely think now more than ever there is a huge possibility that we could see some kind of a sky dimension added to Minecraft. Let me know what you think about these theories down below. As I said, I'm not too sure if I fully believe in this theory, but it's something I've been seeing quite a bit over the past few days, and I really wanted to talk about it. We've all been asking for a sky dimension, the ether dimension, for weeks and weeks and months and months and years at this point, so it would make sense that by now Mojang would have picked up on that. But still, I do not know how likely this actually is. I just want to show you all this tweet, which was also from Notch about 10 plus years ago when the Sky Dimension was originally being worked on and as you can see Notch did not seem too happy with the results and how it all planned out but still for a very long time people said the same thing about the Nether Dimension that it did not look good it had no purpose and honestly people still say that about the End Dimension so I really hope that Mojang will go back again and give it another attempt and try to get the Sky Dimension to work as I said it makes the most sense ever now that we are getting the breeze. As we know though, the developers are incredible, they're always out there looking for new ideas, thoughts, theories and feedback. They're always out there looking for new ideas of what they can add to the game. So if you have any cool suggestions, ideas, theories or thoughts, be sure to drop them down below alongside Do This Mojang. To get your ideas out there, it is a very awesome way to let the developers know some cool content you would like to see. And as always, be sure to check out this video on screen right now for more Minecraft 1.21 news and information. In this video on screen we do talk a lot more about the mob vote and the possibility that it was actually botted. It is very interesting, be sure to check it out. 